In this program, we are going to print user's given number in reverse order. Before we start writing this program, let me explain you the logic. Suppose user has entered 123. So what we can do is using modulus operator, we can divide this number by 10. Okay. So 123 modulus 10 will give me 3. So this is first number of the reverse order. Okay. So we can print it directly and then we need to split this number. So how we can achieve that? we can divide 123 by 10 which will give me 12 okay now we have to perform this and this step again on this number okay so let us try to write this programmatically i'm using rem as remainder and n as user's number so we are asking user to enter his number suppose he has entered 123 so my condition is n greater than 0 that is 123 greater than 0 now what we are doing here is we are storing rem equal to n 123 modulus operator 10 so rem will hold 3 over here so we can directly print it here and then we just have to divide our n by 10 so 123 will become 12 over here okay now we are going back at the top again and the new condition will be 12 greater than 0 which is a true condition so we are going back inside the loop again and here my rem will become 2 why 12 modulus 10 it will give me 2 so we can print it directly over here and then we need to divide this 12 by 10 so i will have my final number 1 that is after i divide 12 by 10 it will give me 1 now we are going back again to check the condition so 1 is greater than 0 which is a true condition here now in the final iteration 1 modulus 10 it will give me 1 because 10 cannot divide 1 so my answer over here will be 1 we can directly print this value here and then finally 1 divided by 10 this will also give me 0 because 10 cannot divide 1 so i have updated value of n which has become 0 so when the compiler goes back again to check the condition we have 0 greater than 0 which is a false condition so by this time our output screen has 3 to 1 which is the reverse order of our original number 123 so as the condition becomes false, control comes out of the loop and program terminate.